so good, Lord, you are good, you've been better than good, I can't praise you enough, I owe you my life, can't praise you enough, even if Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, we bless you today, God. We glorify you, Lord. We honor you, we lift you up, and we praise your name, God. Lord, you are the King of kings. You are the Lord of lords. You are the great I am, and you are greatly to be praised, God. And we just want to tell you thank you on today, God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, Lord. Lord, you have been so good to us. You have been better to us, Lord, than we have been to ourselves, God. And we just want to bless you on today, Father God. Lord, you are our God, our King, and our everything, Lord. And we lift you up and we exalt you, Father God. We exalt you, Father God, and we place you, Lord, on the throne at the head of our life, Father God, and at the center of our hearts where you belong, Lord God. And that's what we desire for you to be, Lord. So, Father God, we just want to tell you thank you on today, Lord God, for all that you are to us and more, Father God. Everything that you stand for represent, Father God. What you mean to us within our lives, Lord God, we cannot even explain it or put it into words, Lord God. And we just want you to know once a day, Father God, you have been so good to us, Lord. And we are truly grateful, Father God, for all that you have done for us, Lord. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, God. The Heavenly Father, I come before you once a day to give you everything that I may carry, Lord, knowingly and unknown, Lord God, that you may fill me up, Father God, until there's nothing left with you, Lord God, that you will take all those things out, Father God, that are not of you, Lord God. So I give you my heart and my mind on today, Father God, that you may enter in and have your way, Lord God. And if there's anything keeping you from entering, Lord God, I'm asking that you'll move it out the way, Father God. I give you full permission, Father God. I grant you access on today, Father God, that you may enter in and have your way, Lord God. Oh God, we all welcome you on today, Father God, each and every one of us, Lord God. We open up ourselves to you, God, that you may enter in and have your way, Lord God. Enter into our hearts, God. Enter in our minds, God, that you may take residence on inside of us, Lord. So, Father God, we ask that you will saturate our atmosphere, Lord, whether we be in our homes, God, whether we be at work, Lord God, in our cars, Father God, wherever we may be, Lord God, consume us on today, Father God, and fill us up with your presence, God. Oh, Lord, we just want to tell you thank you for your warm embrace on today, Father God. We thank you, Lord God, for meeting us right where we are, Father God, each and every day, Lord. Oh, God, I just want to tell you thank you, Lord God. We thank you on today, Father God, for all that you do for us within our life, Father God, for waking us up in the morning, Lord God, and breathing breath within our body, Father God, for being our heart mender, Lord God, for being our protector, Father God, our way maker, Lord God, our soul source, God, our nurturer, our caretaker, Lord God. Oh, God, I just want to tell you thank you, Lord. You have done so much for us, Lord God. We cannot keep count of all that you have done within our lives, and we just want to bless you on today, God. We thank you, Lord God, for all the times that you have saved us, Lord God, for all those times you made a way out of nowhere, Lord God. For all the times that you healed our bodies, Lord God. You healed the brokenness, Lord God. You have restored our hearts, Lord God. Refresh us and revive us, God. We want to tell you thank you on today, God. You have been so good to us, Lord. And we cannot thank you enough, Lord. And we sure enough cannot repay you, Father God, for all that you have done, Lord God. But we want to express to you on today right now, Father God, and let you know that we are grateful, Lord God. That we take nothing for granted, Lord God. If it had not been for you, Lord, we would not be here on today, Father God. If it had not been for you, Lord God, we would not be standing right where we are, Lord God. God, with our eyes to see and our ears to hear, Lord, we want to tell you thank you, Lord God, for the very breath within our body, Lord God. We want to tell you thank you on today, Father God, for the clothes on our back, the shoes on our feet, and the food on our table, Lord God, the transportation that you have provided for us, Lord. Oh, God, we want to tell you thank you for it all, Lord God. We thank you, Father God, for the income that you provide for us, Lord God, for the jobs that you have given us, Lord God. We want to say thank you, Lord God, for the visions and the dreams, God, for the ideas, Lord God. We want to tell you thank you, Father God, for our peace of mind, Father God, for our stability, Lord God. Oh, God, we want to tell you thank you, Lord. Because you have done so much for us, Father God, and you have been so good to us, Lord God. Lord, you are great and worthy to be praised, God, and we just want to bless you on today, Father God. We want to pay respects to you, Father God, with respects are due, Lord God. We want to give you homage, Lord God. We want to tell you, Father God.
that you are the head of our life, Father God, our God, our King, and our everything, God, and we just want to bless you on today, Father God. We want to tell you thank you, Lord God, because we don't tell you thank you enough, Lord God. We want to tell you that we love you and appreciate you, Father God, because we don't tell you enough, Lord God, and we're not always mindful, Father God, of all the things that you do, Lord. So right now, Father God, we want to acknowledge you, Lord God, for everything, Lord God, even the little things, Father God, the things in between, Lord God, known and unknown, Lord. Oh, God, you do so much for us, God. We thank you for the freedom in our minds, Father God, for severing the shackles in the chains, oh God, for breaking the generational curse, Lord God, and the cycles that you have broken within our lives, God. Oh God, I want to tell you thank you, Lord God, for giving us that stability in our mindset, Lord God, for giving us that peace, that love, that joy, that happiness, God. Oh God, we just want to tell you thank you once today, God. We thank you, we thank you, Lord God, because there was a time, Father God, that we were lost, Father God, walking in darkness, Lord, but you shed the light within our life, and we want to tell you thank you, Lord God. There was a time in our life, Father God, we thought we were going to lose our minds, God, but you, Lord God. Help us to find that stability in our minds. We want to tell you, thank you, Lord God. Oh, God, you have been so good to us, Lord. And we want to tell you that we appreciate it, Father God. Because we know, Lord God, it's nothing that we have done, Lord God. It's all because of you, Lord God. We thank you for life, help, and strength on today, Father God. We want to tell you, thank you, Lord God, for our mothers and our fathers, our sisters and our brothers, God. We want to tell you, thank you for our children, Lord God, and our grandchildren, Lord God. We want to tell you, thank you for our husband and our wives, and our way to come, Lord God. All that you have done, Lord God, all that you're providing us with, Lord God, everything that you have allowed us to obtain, Lord God. It's all because of you, and we want to tell you thank you, Lord God. Even though that we may face trials and tribulations and tests, God, and the challenges, Lord God, you are the one who gives us the bravery to do the thing, Lord God. You take away the fears, Lord God, the shame and the embarrassment, Lord, and we want to tell you thank you for it, Lord. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, God. We thank you, Lord God, when we need to climb that mountain that you equipped us to, to climb that mountain, Lord God. We want to tell you thank you today when we was at that roadblock, Father God, and we didn't know which way to go that you gave us direction, Lord. Oh, Father God, we just want to tell you thank you on today, Father God. Lord, if it had not been for you, then we don't know what we would be, Lord God. We thank you, Father God, for giving your only son to shed his blood for us, Lord God, who died on the cross, Father God. Oh, God, we want to tell you thank you, Lord God, for the stripes on his back that he received, Father God. We want to tell you thank you, Lord God, it when you gave your son, Father God, you made the ultimate sacrifice for us, Lord God, and we may be able to live this life, Lord God. Oh God, we want to tell you thank you, Lord God. You're so mindful, caring, and so concerned about us, Lord, and we just want to bless you on today, Father God. Lord, you do so much for us, Lord God. We don't even have enough time to tell you thank you, Lord God. We cannot even, Father God, make a list of all that you have done, Lord God, because we'll leave something out, Father God. So on today, Father God, we thank you for everything, Father God, for the big and the little, Father God, the good and the bad, the happy and the sad, God, the expected and the unexpected, Lord. We just want to tell you, thank you for everything, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for what you're doing for us right now, Father God, and everything that you're about to do, Lord God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, Lord. Oh, God, we just bless you today, Lord. We thank you, Father God, for your forgiveness and your grace and your mercy that you renew to us each and every day, Father God, moment by moment, second by second, hour by hour, God. We want to tell you thank you, Lord God. We thank you for that unconditional love that you have for us, Lord, that you outpour into us each and every day, Lord God. Oh, God, continue to fill us up until our cups overflow, Lord God. Fill us up with more of your spirit, God, more of your love, Father God, more of your grace and mercy, Lord God, that we may extend that same grace and mercy that you have given to us, Father God, to those around us, God. God. Oh, God, we just want to say thank you, Lord. You've been so good to us, Lord, and we can't thank you enough, Father God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, Lord. So, Father God, right now, we ask that you will forgive us for our sins, Lord God, knowingly and unknowingly, Lord God. Whether we thought of things, spoke of things, Father God, acted upon a thing, Lord, whatever it was, God, it caused to be in sin, Father God, caused not to be pleasing in your sight, God. We ask that you would forgive us today, Father God, because we want to be pleasing in your sight, God. We want to make you smile, Lord God, and we know that we make mistakes each and every day, Father God, and that's why we need your help, God. So, Lord we ask for your help on today, Father God, to get these things right, Lord God, that you will continue to correct us in the air in our ways, Lord God. Help us to right our wrongs, Lord God. Have a heart of flesh, Lord God, that we may have a heart of flesh. Flourish, thrive, and grow, Father God, even the more, Lord God, that we can continue, Father God, to be more like you, Lord God. Our walk and our talk, Father God, our ways of thinking, Lord God, in every way, Lord God. Oh God, we just want to tell you thank you, Lord God, because we did not recognize these things on our own, Lord God. It was you that brought these things to our attention, God. And oh God, we just want to tell you thank you, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for helping us to become everything that you have designed for us to be, Lord God. Everything that you have preordained and predestined for us to be, the men and women of God that you have created for us to be, Lord. And we want to tell you thank you. 
you, Lord God. That you are helping us to evolve, Lord God. That you are helping us, Father God, to change the way that we used to be, Lord God. Oh God, we thank you, Lord God, for each and every change that you have brought within our life, Father God. Whether it be good or bad, Lord God, because we know that it was all intention and purpose for your purpose, Lord God. Everything happens for a reason, Lord God. So we thank you for it all on today, Father God. The good, the bad, the happy, and the sad, Father God. The known and the known, unknown, Father God. The expected and the unexpected, Lord. Oh God, we just want to tell you thank you, Lord God, because we know that we can't have the good without the bad, Lord God. The happy without the sad, Father God. The expected without the unexpected, Lord God. The known without the unknown, Lord God. We thank you for all these things, Lord God, because all these things come together to make up the story that you have written for us, Lord God. And we thank you for the story that you are writing for us, Lord God. Every part and every puzzle piece that you're putting together, Lord, we want to say thank you for it, God. We thank you, Father God, for being the author of our story, Father God. We want to tell you thank you, Lord God. Oh, God, we just want to say thank you, Father God for the story that you're writing for us, Lord God, and every piece that you're putting together, Lord God, and the way, Father God, that you are allowing things to transpire within our life, God. We want to tell you thank you, Father God, because we are in awe of everything that you do within our lives, Lord God. We are in awe, Father God, of the way that you allow the sun to rise, Father God, and the clouds to sit in the sky, Lord God. We are in awe, in awe Father God, of the way that you created each and every bird, Father God, and each and every chirp that they have, Father God. We are in awe, Father God, of the way that you allow the grass to grow, Father God, and leaves on the trees, Father God, to follow to come back, Lord. Oh, God, you are so magnificent, Father God, and we just cannot compare anything in this land and this earth as to you, Father God. You are greater than all the earth, Lord God, and we just bless you today, Father God. Oh, God, we ask right now, Lord God, that you will forgive us, Father God. We have exalted anything higher than you, Lord God, because nothing is greater than you, Lord God. Nothing is bigger than you, Father God, and, and nothing can compare to you, God. So on today, Father God, we ask that you will forgive us, Lord God, and we apologize, Lord, if we have exalted anything higher than you, Lord God, because we know that our problems are less than nothing, Father God. They're just dropping a bucket, Lord God, and there's nobody within this land, Father God, that compares to you, Lord God. There's nobody greater than you, Lord God, in all the earth, Lord God. You are our God, our King, and our everything, God, and we bless you, Lord God. You are he who is, who was, and who is to come, Father God. You are the great I am, and we bless you today, Lord. Oh, God, you are so amazing to us, God. You are amazing, God. You are a wonderful, God. And we just want you to know how much you mean to us, Lord God. Because you always let us know, Father God, how much you care for God. You always letting us know, Father God, how much we mean to you. So on today, Father God, we come before you right now and let you know how much you mean to us, Lord God. And let you know, Father God, we know that you have been so good to us, Lord God. And we see it, Lord God. And we don't take it for granted, Lord God. We cherish all that you do for us within our lives, God. And we thank you for being so good to us, Lord God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, God. We bless you today, Lord. You have been so, so, so good to us, Lord God, each and every day, Father God, month by month, day by day, week by week second by second, hour by hour, God, you have been good to us, Lord God. That grace and mercy, Father God, that you renew to us each and every day that we have not earned and don't even deserve it, God, but you still give it to us anyway, Lord God. The blessing that you give us each and every day, Father God. We can't earn these things, Lord God, but you give it to us, Lord, because you love us so much and we want to say you thank you, God. So, God, I'm asking right now, Lord, that you continue, Lord God, to touch our loved ones, Lord God. That you continue, Father God, not only to touch our loved ones, Lord God, but even those that we don't know, Lord. Father God, I'm asking right now in the name of Jesus, God, that you would touch the strangers on the street, Father God, and even the people that we meet, God. Oh, God, I'm asking, Lord God, that you continue, Lord God, to touch the homeless people on today, Lord God. I'm asking right now, Father God, you would touch the cashiers, Lord God, that you would touch those, Father God, who are working out in the cold, Lord God. I'm asking, Lord God, that you would touch them in a mighty way on today, Father God. Lord, there's so many people, Father God, that you place on our hearts and our minds, God, and we just want you to see about them on today, Father God. And we're interceding on their behalf, Lord God. So, God, I'm asking right now, Father God, that you would touch all the people, Lord God, across this entire nation, Lord God, north, south, east, and west, Father God, every color, Lord God, every age group, Lord, every religion, Father God, touch them, Lord God, in a mighty way on today, Father God, touch our loved ones, Lord God, who may be in a place of loss and sadness, Lord God, who may be out with, be without their loved one, Lord God, that they, they used to spend the holidays with, Lord God, I'm asking that you will uplift any grief and any sadness on today, Father God, let them know, Lord God, that you are their comfort on today, Father God, let them know on today, Father God, that you can uplift that thing, Lord God, let them know, Father God, that even though they may be absent, and Father God, in physicalness, Lord God, they are there in spirit, God. God, I'm asking right now to you wrap your arms around your people on today, Father God. Touch all those children, Lord God, who may be without a family on today, Father God. Let them know that you, Father God, 
all their father and their mother and their sister and their brother, Lord God, that they are loved, Lord God. Oh God, I'm asking on today, Father God, they will feel their unconditional love, Lord God, and not their spirit of sadness and loneliness, Lord God. Oh Lord, touch all the children on today, Father God. Even touch the adults, Lord God. Those who may be spending the holidays alone, Father God, in this time of year, take them to a place of sadness and depression, God. Oh God, I'm asking that you will rock them in your arms, God, and that you will cradle and comfort them, Lord God, and that feeling, Father God, of absence, Father God, and infants, Lord God, will disappear, Lord. Oh God, I'm asking that you will touch them on today, Father God, because they need your touch, Lord God, because so many of your people, Father God, who get to their place of sadness, alone, and depression, Lord God, and they feel like they have no worth and no value, Lord God, they don't even need to be in existence, Lord God. But God, I'm asking that you let them know on today, Father God, that they are healed, Lord God, they have a reason and a purpose, Lord God, and that you have a plan for them, Lord, as a good and out of evil, God. So Lord, I'm asking on today, Lord God, that you allow them to cross paths with some, Lord, someone, Lord God, that will plant their seed, that will hear that word on today, Father God, and they will know, Father God, that they are here, Father God, not by chance, oh God, but you are the one, Father God, who brought them into existence, Lord God. Oh God, we want to tell you thank you on today, Father God, because it was because of you that we are standing here today, Lord God. That our children are here, Lord God, our mothers and our fathers, Lord God, and even those, Father God, who has passed on before us, Lord God, it was all because of you, Lord God, that we were even, Father God, be able to be connected to them, Lord God. And we want to tell you thank you, Lord God, for even allowing us, Father God, to be able to experience life with them, Father God, for no matter how long of a time, Father God, that you allowed us to, Lord, we want to tell you thank you for it, Lord. We thank you for that opportunity, Lord God. We thank you, Father God, for allowing us to borrow them, Lord God, because we know, Father God, that we all have a time, Father God, but we don't know when it is up, Lord God. So we want to tell you thank you, Lord God, for the time that you allow us to spend with one another, Lord God. We thank you. We thank you, Lord God. We bless you on today, God. Lord, I'm asking on today, Father God, that those that we have brought before you individually, Lord God, and that you have placed on our hearts and our minds before our faith, God, we uplift them up to you on today, Father God. I'm asking that you would touch my harvest time ministry in the national family, Lord God. You know them by name, Lord God. You know the numbers of hairs on their head, Lord God. You know exactly the proper worry and concern, Lord God. I'm asking that you would touch my family on today, Father God. You know their needs, God. I'm asking that you provide and meet the needs, Lord God, according to your will, your purpose, and your perfect time, Lord God. Oh God, I just want to tell you thank you right now, Father God, for everything that you're about to do within our lives, Father God, everything that you have done, Lord God, and everything to come, Lord God. I thank you, I thank you, Lord God. I thank you on today, Father God, for being so, so good to us, Lord God. You just don't know, Lord. We are truly grateful, Father God. Oh, God, we just want to tell you thank you, Lord God, because we know we have not expressed it enough, Lord God. So, right now, Father God, we're expressing, Lord God, from the very peace of our heart, Father God, from the depths of our soul, God. We just say thank you, Lord God, because you have better, been better to us than we have been to ourselves, God. And we want you to know, Father God, that we are grateful for it, Lord. So, God, I'm asking on today, Lord God, you will touch your people, Lord God, and they will remember, Father God, this season that you are the reason for this season, Lord God. And we bless you and we honor you on today, Father God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, Lord. Heavenly Father, I'm asking right now, Lord, that you would continue to touch the prayers on the prayer wall, God. Continue to touch the prayers on the altar and the altar box, oh God. And that you continue, Father God, to consider each and every prayer on the side of our hearts, God. And our subconscious thinking, Lord God. Those prayers that we have written in our prayer journals, Lord God, and in our prayer closets, Lord God. I'm asking that you consider all the prayers, Lord God. And let them not have any hidden motives, God, or any hidden agendas, Lord God. And according to your will and your purpose, God, let your will be done, Father God. Let the prayers be released, Father God. And we thank you for answering those prayers, God. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, Lord. We bless you, God. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, we thank you, Lord. Lord, I pray this prayer, Father God, in your son, Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, you have been so good to us, and we just want you to know that we are grateful, God. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. You have been so good to us, Lord. So, so good. Oh, God, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. We can never repay you for all that you have done. We thank you, God. For what you've done for me. How you loose my shackles. How you set us free, Lord. How you set me free. How you made a way. You made a way out of no way, time and time again. 
And we thank you, God. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. Oh, we thank you, God. I thank you guys for joining us, Father God. Oh, we thank you, God. I thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Whew. I thank everyone for joining us for noonday prayer. Invite somebody and share that they may be able to get their prayer for the day as well. I pray that you guys have a wonderful and blessed day. I want to invite you guys tomorrow to service at the sanctuary at Harvest Time Ministry International at 2912 Dolphin Island Parkway, Suite H. You can't miss it. Come in. We will be there for Christmas, giving God all the glory because he is the reason for it all. So make time for God on tomorrow. He is the reason for the season. And I thank you all. Have a blessed and beautiful day. And you can join us back here on Tuesday for 6 p.m. prayer as well. I love you all. Have a blessed day.